hackers who get close. We've sent soldiers for defense, but the Hakonites are cunning, merciless, and know the basin better than we do. I'm afraid our men will not be able to hold out long. I should go. Be careful out there. I mean, Scout Harding has an impressive team. Her people brought back a number of artifacts. We've had bad luck with artifacts before. I hope none of them explode. What? No, no, I, I don't mean magical artifacts. I meant belt buckles and old nails and the like. Barring enchantment, cloth and leather will have long since rotted away. Only metal and stone remain recognizable. Complicating this are recent pieces the Avar left behind, and, of course, ancient pieces dating back to Tevinter. Fortunately, thanks to some period-specific buckling, I've been able to track our last Inquisitor. You said there were pieces dating back to Tevinter? Yes. While it's rare to see Tevinter ruins so far south, the Imperium once had an outpost of some sort here. They might have built it as a, a ritual site. I'm not sure what military value it could have. In any event, it's muddled up the research slightly, but I've accounted for it. You lost me at buckling. You'd think that a buckle was a buckle. But ever since people started belting on weapons, they've been adding bits. One piece here has a dragon engraving. With the alloys of the metals used, it's clearly Tevinter. While this one uses a clasp that wasn't invented until the dawn of the Elysian Empire. And when it comes to historical research, you might say we have to buckle down. 
<laughs> what do you have, Professor? Everything so far points to the shore, not far to the south. There was some sort of battle near the shoreline, and they were in a hurry. The scouts reported an island near an Avar fishing camp, but the Avar won't say much about it. I'll find a way to that island and see if there's anything useful there. Excellent. I'll continue to study what's been found. With luck, we'll both find some answers. Also, one of my research assistants, Colette, was investigating an old structure to the north. I'm not certain that it's related to our investigation, but it couldn't hurt to check with her. For hating the outdoors, you really do seem to like bad weather. What's that now? The other day, you were outside in the rain, staring up with a grin on your face. I smile at clouds. Of course you do. What? I should hunch and swear at the rain pissing off my nose. Let the weather win. I smile the freak out of clouds. Maybe they get tired of trying. Are we still talking about clouds? What? Never mind. Drinks and insults later? We're both buying. Then there's double. <laughs> <laughs> 